know it. When I was putting together this evening, I was thinking that I would close it off. But it wasn't until a couple days ago that my son told me what I should say. And I thought, well, why don't you just come and say it then? And so, the baby child is really powerful. And God says in his words that we are not to judge them because they are young. So he has a message from God for all of you. John 3.16 says, For God so loved the world and so much that he gave his one and only son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. Romans 3.23 says, For all have sinned and fallen short of God's glorious standard. Romans 10.9 says, If you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. And John 20.29 20, says, then Jesus told Thomas, You will leave because you have seen me. Blessed are those who believe without seeing me. These words are spoken directly from God to you. He loves you that much. And we hope that at some point in this night, you felt God tugging in your heart. Whether you've known him for years, whether you've been seeking him, or whether you didn't even know what you were looking for, but you knew something was missing. So I ask all of you to bow your heads. And if you feel God calling you to this, I'll just pray a little prayer. And you can pray it to yourself in your hearts. God will hear it, and he will bless you. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for this evening. Thank you that you are here, that you love each and every woman in their own unique way. You know what they're going through, what they've been through, and where they're going. I pray that we would all ask forgiveness and ask you to come in and be the Lord of our lives and our Savior. And it's as simple as that. Lord, we thank you that you sent your son to die on the cross for us, for me, and for each individual one of you. And time is short, Lord. We can't put this choice off to another day anymore, because that is a choice. I pray that we would have the courage to just let it go and give it all to you. In Jesus' name. Now, if, if you want to talk to someone about this, or if you do want to pray in person with someone, we'll have a few ladies, maybe in that back corner over there at the end, if you want to go talk to them, or you can ask questions, or come and find someone that was up here tonight. And we thank you for all coming, and hope you enjoy the evening.